Hey, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII, where last time I started the game, we blew up the North Mako reactor, and now we're on a train. So, let's talk to everyone, shall- Oh, hello. Don't bother the other passengers. Well, fine. Be that way. Hey, Barrett. Can I talk to you? Hey. Speak. Speak human words. Stop acting like a dumb kid. Just sit down and shut up. Okay, speak nicer words, please. Hey. This train hasn't switched to security mode yet. I'm sure that will change by tomorrow. Hey, Wedge. Someday, Avalanche is going to be famous, and me, too. Hey, Cloud, you want to look at this with me? It's a map of the Midgar rail system. Let's look at it together. I'll explain it to you. I like this kind of stuff. Bombs and monitors, you know, flashy stuff. Can't get more flashy than bombs. Okay, it's about to start. Whoa. This is a complete model of the city of Midgar. It's about one, one, one ten thousand scale. Is that right? Yes, that is right. I read that correctly. The top plate is about 50 meters above ground. A main pillar supports the plate in the center, and there are other support pillars built in each station, section. Psst. Whisper, whisper. The number one reactor we blew up was in the northern section. Then, there's number two, number three, all the way up to the number eight reactor. The eight reactors provide Midgar with electricity. Each town used to have a name, but no one in Midgar remembers them. Instead of names, we refer to them by number sectors. That's how things turned out. Phew! Look what's next! Look! This is the route this train is on. The route pillar- uh, the route pillars around the main pillar. We should be coming around the center. Right now. Each checkpoint has an ID sensor device. It checks the identities and backgrounds of each passenger on the train. And is linked up to the central data. Bank. Head Shinra headquarters. We definitely look suspicious, so we're using fake IDs. Some high-tech security- whoa! Speak of the devil! That light means that we're in the ID security check area. When the lights go off, you never know what kind of creeps will show up, will come out. We're almost back now. What a relief. Um... Okay. Don't bother the other passengers, that's fine. Look, you can see the surface now. This city don't have no day or night. If that plate weren't there, we could see the sky. A floating city. Pretty unsettling scenery. Huh? Never expect to hear that out of someone like you. You just full of surprises. The upper world. A city on a plate. It's because of that <laughs> curse word pizza. All right, that people underneath are suffering. And the city below is full of polluted air. On top of that, the reactors keep, that the reactor keeps draining up all the energy. Then, why doesn't every, everyone move onto the plate? Don't know, probably because they ain't got no money or maybe, because they love their land. No matter how polluted it gets. I know. No one lives in the slums. Because they want to. It's like this train. It can't run anywhere except where its rails take it. You know what? I actually never knew that Cloud talked. I spent my entire life once this game released thinking that Cloud was mute. I don't know why. I don't know where it came from. <laughs> Okay, that's a little unsafe, jumping down the stairs like that. Okay, Biggs! Yeah. 
Yo, get over here. All ya. Alright. This mission was a success, but don't get lazy now. The hard part's come still to come. Don't y'all be scared of that explosion. Never mind the fact that it almost killed all of us, because the next one's going to be bigger than that. Meet back at the hideout. Move out. All right, then. Let's go. Hey, <laughs> you want to meet your little baby? Little baby? Hey, don't act like you don't know what I mean. I'm telling you. Um, okay, go on ahead. Hello, Papa! Tifa! Aren't you- Marlene? Aren't you going to say anything to Cloud? Welcome home, Cloud. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Barrett? Yeah. I should have known. He's always pushing people around. And you've always been in fights ever since you were little. I was worried. Tifa! Long time no see! Flowers! How nice! You almost never see them here in the slums. But... A flower for me? Oh, Cloud, you shouldn't have. I'm gonna give it to Marlene. Huh? Hey. Sorry, Cloud. Marlene seems a little shy. Hey, Biggs. Ah, nothing like that first drink after a job. <laughs> Why don't you have to have one too? Yeah, why not? Oh, that's more like it. Even if you were with Soldier, you're still a rookie here, so you'd better listen to whatever I tell you. Hey, Wedge. Oh, Cloud. Tifa really knows how to cook. Mmm. Anyway, let me tell you something. About what? Tifa always lets me taste her cooking. And look at me now. I'm roly poly. Don't know whether I should be happy or sad. But it's the good food and drink that makes uh, this shop famous. Hey, Jesse. Hey, Wedge, you're getting all excited. Stop making such a mess. Um, oh. Whoa, Barrett. Papa, welcome home! Yeah. Huh? Where'd you get that flower? Cloud gave it to me. Oh. Did you thank him? Hmm. Thank you, Cloud. We'll take care of you. You alright, Barrett? Great! Get in here, fools. We're starting the meeting. Uh... Okay. Pinball machine away! <laughs> Wait, no. No. Pinball machine away! Oh, this place is cool. Oops. Hey, look at the news. What a blast. Think it was all because of my bomb? But all I really did was just make it, like the computer told me. Oh no. I must have made a miscalculation somewhere. Hey, Wedge. You think I'm a little too uptight? Not at all. Well, that's okay. Don't worry about me. I don't look like it. I'm a coward at heart. Um... Uh, I want to talk to Biggs. He's just hanging out all by himself. Um. Whoa. The next mission will be to blow up the Sector 5 reactor. Cloud, you're great. Don't you ever get nervous? Or are you, like, impre previous to feelings? Nah, that couldn't be it. Alright then. Hello. Yo, Cloud. There's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? None. I'm positive. 
You sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from Soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you so bad just because you you was in Soldier. That was hard for me to read. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, you're strong. Probably all them guys in Soldier are. But don't forget that your skinny ass is working with for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging on to Shinra. Staying with Shinra? You asked me you asked me a question, and I answered it, that's all. I'm going upstairs. I wanna talk about my money. Now don't find from Marlene. Wait, Cloud Tifa, let me let him go. Looks like he still misses the Shinra. Shut up! I don't care about neither Shinra nor Soldier. But don't get me wrong, I don't care about Avalanche or the planets for that matter. Going up! Oh, we really made Barrett mad. Tifa! Listen, Cloud, I'm asking you to please join us. Sorry, Tifa. The planet is dying. Slowly but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. So, let Barrett and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. Well, I'm pretty sure that when the planet eventually dies and everyone dies on it, uh, it will have something to do with you. So? You're really leaving? You're just going to walk right out, ignoring your childhood friend? What? How can you say that? Um... I'm gonna say sorry. You forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you did forget. Remember, Cloud? It was seven years ago. And we haven't changed in all that seven years. Look! The wall. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you would never come. And I was getting a little cold. Oh, that was just us reminiscing. Oh god, it's Little Cloud. Sorry, I'm late. You said you wanted to talk to me about something. Come the spring, I'm leaving town for Midgar. All the boys are leaving town. But I'm different from them. I'm not just going to find a job. Oh god, he has a ponytail. I want to join Soldier. I'm going to be the best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth? The great Sephiroth? Uh, hello, Cloud. Isn't it hard to join Soldier? I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. Um, if you get really famous and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come save me, alright? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. What? Come on, promise me! Alright, I promise. And flashback over! Ooh, commemorate it with a shooting star. You remember now, don't you? I promise. Well, I remember the shooting star. I'm not a hero, and I'm not, and I'm not famous. So I can't keep our promise. 
But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on. You've got to keep your promise. Uh, Barrett? Wait, a bit- wait a sec, big time soldier. A promise is a promise. Here. Received Barrett Stash. 1500 gil. This is my pay? Don't make me laugh. Wait, uh, what? Then you'll- You got the next mission lined up? I'll do it for 3000. What? It's okay, it's okay. Psst. We're really hurting for help, right? Ugh. That money's for Marlene's schooling. Two thousand. Thanks, Cloud. Did I sleep down in the home base? Alright. Hello. Good morning, Cloud. Did you sleep well? Barrett's snoring kept me up. <laughs> Next to you, who wouldn't? I don't know what you mean. I'm going this time. Okay. Hey, Marlene! She just waves at you! That's actually pretty adorable. Our target is the Sector 5 reactor. Head for the station first. I'll fill you in on the train. Yo, Cloud. Before the next mission, I got something I want to ask you. I, uh... I don't really know how to use Materia. I'll give you that Materia we found. Just teach me how to use it. Uh, okay. I'll explain it. Sure. I'll explain how Materia works. First, access the menu. You know, the basic functions. Press triangle button to bring up the menu. Directional buttons to move the cursor. Like this. Select each menu by using cross button. If you want to leave the menu, just press circle button. See? Let's go ahead. Now, you're in, the mi in this menu. Select the Materials submenu. Select who you want to use it. Now, look at my weapon here. Each weapon and armor has slots in it. Choose which slot you want to put Materia in. Now, select the Materia you want to use. This is curative materia. If you want to know what its effects is... Oh god. Line the cursor up with the check menu. The anticipation is killing me. Press the cross button. It's just like selecting battle commands. Just line the cursor up to magic. It gives me cure! You can see that the available magic has increased. Awesome. Now you can use magic cure. And that's all there is to equipping materia. See? It wasn't that tough. When you want to remove any materia, don't you dare. It's as easy as pointing at the materia slot and pressing triangle button. I hate you so much right now. There's just one thing you have to be careful of. Whenever you equip the materia, your situation changes. Parts of you may become stronger while others get weaker. Normally, when you equip magic materia, your magic power will get stronger, but your physical strength weakens. So, materia is kind of a double-edged sword. On the left side of the screen, you can see the materia's effects on you. It's wise not to overuse materia, magic materia, but try out various things. Press circle button on to exit the submenu. Oops. No! I keep skipping all the dialogue. It's fine. It's just tutorial. What's this? It wasn't that tough? Crap. Watch your language. There's a child. I don't get it. You just handle the materia cloud. 
Yay, material system. Cloud, I got a message from the weapon shop man upstairs. He has something he wants to give you. Don't forget. Marlene, you watch the store while we're gone. Alright, good luck. Uh, man upstairs. Okay. Where do I go then? Um. Oh, hello. This place has an upstairs. Okay. Oh, hey! hey. Ooh, he. Hey. Wait a minute, you. You can't just walk out of here without buying something. Might be unhealthy for you. If you know what I mean. Ooh. Um. I'm gonna get three of these. Uh, Barrett already has one. I'm gonna get a couple of grenades, because I don't exactly know how to use them, so it's great to test it out. Let's go upstairs. Hmm. Uh, oops. There we go. Hello. Hey, save point! Perfect! Let's use this real quick. And save. Right down here. Perfect. And I guess that gives me a chance to end the video. No, excuse me. Alright. I'm gonna go over here. Thank you for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, please press that little subscribe button. It helps out a lot. And if you like this video specifically, please like this video. Next time, I'm going to look for that junk man, junk store person that has uh, what I am owed. <laughs> Hopefully for free. Uh, or has what he wanted to give me, hopefully for free. Um, and uh, then I'll see what happens next time. Uh, I think I'm going to the Sector 5 reactor, if I remember correctly. So, that's what I'm doing. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.